welcome back to my youtube channel so basically today as you can see from the photo and thumbnail i'm gonna be doing a personal q a and i decided to film this video because i want you guys my current subscribers and you that will subscribe to the lady that is watching that will subscribe to my channel today to know who you're subscribing to so these are just some personal questions that um i searched out and i joined everything package together in one um so just to make this video and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already turn on your post notifications so you can get inside and it's an i post the video because you don't want to miss my videos i post good videos right here like i post essential videos helpful videos and a lot more of all kinds of videos tips how to videos outfit videos just think about it we post it right here so subscribe to my channel and 56 percent of you guys are watching my channel and not even subscribed what are you waiting for subscribe to my channel please and also follow all my socials down below as well as on the screen without being said let's just get right into today's video so what the first question here is are you easy to get along with so i'm going to say this in two ways yes and no yes because i'm very open-minded and i love to make friends and i'm just like a plain sheet i just i just like understanding the way people are and no because sometimes me being outspoken it might seem like i'm rude or something if you don't understand me like i'm very outspoken and i like to like tell people when they get me pissed or when you do something i don't like so me doing that might seem like um this person she rude but actually i'm just being outspoken so next question is what are your bad habits oh my god i have two bad habits right now the first one is procrastination like i procrastinate a lot and i actually want to stop it like i seriously want to stop procrastinating it's not nice procrastination procrastination is not nice i'm really battling with that right now and the mom gets mad at me for procrastinating and all that but anyways and the second one is um i'm like i'm very bad when it comes to like um decision making like i am very very indecisive at times so like maybe when it comes to the nails i want to do my hair the outfit i want to wear for today and stuff like that i am very very indecisive at times because like i don't know very very indecisive you are always conscious, small, small kind of thing. The things to buy, the things I don't know. Like, especially when it comes to pouch, like, I can have this much. This is one of my longest pouch that I've owned since I've had this one. And the reason is because we are in quarantine. During coronavirus, I can't go out and where I would get my cute pouch, I can't go there yet because of what is going on in this world right now. So, I'm very, very innocent and it's very happy. So the next on the list is where would you travel? Where would you like to travel to? So I have two places I like to travel to. The first place is um, LA, Los Angeles, and the second is South Korea. So I just want to travel to South Korea because I feel like they are just I want to explore because I love exploring. So I want to explore their kind of life. I want to explore their traditions. I want to explore the way they do things and stuff like that. So that's why I want to travel to South Korea. Career. but when i say that people just laugh at me like most of my friends my family just laugh at me but i really want to go there then the next is um what is your favorite part of your daily routine okay my favorite part of my daily routine is when i pray yeah so it's when i pray and the reason is because during this quarantine before i came home for quarantine i was really 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 getting close to god in school and i'm so happy about like getting close to god i'm so happy about living this lifestyle it's just a plain lifestyle i don't care what other people say i don't care what people say about me my lifestyle right now because i i cared i cared before but now i don't care i don't i don't care what you think about my life but i just my daily routine what i love in my daily routine right now is when i pray because it's awesome it's good like it's just opened my eyes to many things it's just opened my eyes to many kind of situations it opened my eyes like i can answer the question if someone asked me where will you be in the next three years i can answer that there's a lot of things that changed in my life that changed for the better during this break and the fact that i've been close to god like i can see the difference between my life now and then so um, the next is how old are you i'm 20 years old so the next question is when is your birthday my birthday is october 10. next question is what is your zodiac sign zodiac sign libra my zodiac sign is libra 
So the next question is bath or showers? Shower because I love to um oh my god I love to play in the rain so um I just feel like that shower it comes down like when you're in the shower to your hair your face everywhere it looks like the rain you're just standing and I do a lot of stupid things in the shower I become an actress in the shower anyways but that's what we're talking about but I love shower so three things I love I've had those questions now for like a whole week since Monday and I've been thinking about the three things I love till now but I think I have my answer now three things I love the first is experiment which I said before I love to explore second is um I love to watch movies like I literally love to watch movies I could literally stay and watch a movie for a whole day without standing up in fact without eating just give me popcorn and basically maybe any other kind of snacks so that's how much I love watching TV and next I think the last thing that I love is fashion me so I love fashion I love to put things together I love to see how I can merge this outfit and this outfit so the next question is um, my eye color my eye color is brown yeah my eye color is brown then the next is eye color my eye color is coffee brown coffee brown since when I was a baby to now my eye color is coffee brown and I don't know why because I actually cut my hair back in high school and I was thinking it was going to grow but nah it did not it did not grow at all it, no sorry it grew but I meant I think I was thinking it was going to grow black but it did not grow it still grew brown so since then I left it even most people walk up to me in my school or maybe when I'm just out and they ask that sorry did you dye your hair and I'm like no I did not that's how bad it is my hair is coffee brown so well, how long does it take you to get ready in the morning Ooh, i don't know i don't know i don't know i've not really thought about how long i've not really calculated how long it takes me to get ready in the morning but i'm thinking i would say um up to 30 to 40 minutes because what what waste my time is my hair and my outfits to wear for that day i know we have been indoor but sometimes i still love to dress up for myself these days i've been trying to dress up for myself because even if i'm not feeling that day or even if i'm not doing anything i'm not going out but i'm just trying to dress up for myself to feel better to feel okay and all that so outfit and my hair takes time because if you guys didn't know if you checked my last video my hair was very long the hair i fixed the weave that i fixed was very long but i cut it very short i'm gonna review that soon but i've been getting some cute ways to pack the air so i tell it to pack the air right now to film this video but very soon i'm gonna be reviewing how short the air is so i've never thought but i would say maybe 30 to 40 minutes so least favorite subject physics i hate physics youtuber so my ultimate favorite youtuber is sarah jimpet and it's because she's my inspiration on youtube she's the one that keeps me um keep to let me keep going to keep pushing forward because being successful on youtube is not just a day journey it's not just a day, a day job it's not just a day thing you need to keep pushing and keep improving on yourself and keep just doing that thing which you do so she's the one and she's just my inspiration about youtube so next is celebrities so i have to the first one is jace norman um he started in every danger as Henry Hart. Oh, that guy is my celebrity crush. He's my celebrity crush, but I also like him. I like everything about him and stuff like that. Then next is Kira Kurasi. She starred in The Thunderman as Phoebe Thunderman. So I love her. Also, I love everything about her. She's just so nice, so cute, so beautiful. I don't know, but that's just my two celebrities. Then um, next is my worst day ever so this was back in high school guys um i had a crush on this guy during we were close to the period of during our holidays where we'll be in school that was in my last year of um high school so i had a crush on this guy and he somehow found out about me having a crush on him and he called me as like literally it was on the phone we spoke because we were actually friends like friends but not like really close friends at that bubble friends so he called we were chatting one day we were talking and he called me and told me he couldn't date me that he doesn't like me that he was already dating someone else i was so 
embarrassed and so sad and I felt like rejected. The point is I never even asked him out. I never wanted to ask him out. I just know that I just had a crush on him. That's all. Because one thing with me, even if I have a crush on you, I would never tell you. I would never say it. But so I'm thinking throughout my life from my childhood to now, that's been my worst day ever. So the next question is dream job. My dream job is to become an actress. Actually, I love acting so much. So awesome. Next up is color. My best color is black. Black is my best color. I'm not going anywhere without black. Like black. Most of my clothes are black. So black is my best color. Even my nails. I love doing my nails are black. But it's just that my mom doesn't like it. So that's fine. But guys, like my nails, oh, see it. Like that was I think yesterday. I don't even know what happened. I just made my nails like this. Hmm, and it feels hard. You see the remaining super cute and then it's just hard. But I still have the news anyways, so I need to be fast. So next up is pet names. So I think I just have one pet name of which someone calls me, which is Chipmunk. And I'm like, oh, why? What? Why would someone call me Chipmunk? And I said it's because Chipmunks are cute and I'm cute. I don't just know, but anyways video games so uh, video games for me i would say uh mortal combat yeah is that the name mortal combat yeah i really like that game because i hate football i hate football like i hate football so i would say okay mortal combat because i recently played that game and it was super interesting so good so cute so i would say mortal combat so the next question is have you ever lost a loved one yes i've lost a loved one one which was my dad when my mom was still pregnant so um, the one i've always been talking about is my stepdad which is very very nice sometimes i don't even get to like i don't feel the pain of not having a father seriously he's, he's very good very nice and i love him so much so the next question is being in a car accident yeah i've been in a car accident while traveling to my hometown before yeah so i've been in a car accident so the next is three fears so my three fears the first one is lizard it might sound weird but i'm scared of lizard <laughs> and i'm scared of cockroaches <laughs> and last but not least i'm scared of someone breaking my heart when i mean breaking my heart i mean betraying me as a friend i don't really know but i'm very open-minded and i love to share my experience share my ideas with someone when i think you are very close to me and i really like you so i don't know but i just have that fear i have that fear so next question is what first thing i notice in a new person so if me and you were chatting and we are talking the first thing i notice is if something comes out if something productive comes out of our conversation because i can't just be seeing you for the first time and we're talking we'll surely have fun we'll talk fun things but i want to see if we can be productive to each other do you get me like because i feel i am my best to grace we are productive to each other like we tend to talk to ourselves we sure it's just that's what i think i feel i i notice in the first person and i'm so sorry about the noise guys uh, there's no light for the past three days now yeah i think yeah three days because rain i'm thinking rain rain is rain acoustics because rain has been falling heavily for the past three days and i think the lights fall or something so i'm sorry for the noise is gen but anyways next question is what talent do you have so this is a big question for me when i initially saw it because really guys if you ask me about the talent oh i was so super scared at times not like a super scared or something but people always made fun of me one certain time and that's what actually made me grow up people always made fun of me because I don't know how to dance and I don't know how to sing. So they said that's not a talent. And one freaking day I got to realize that a talent is not about singing, it's not about the general things that is going on. It's about what you love. It's about what you love doing, it's about what you are good at. And I realized I'm very good at acting, guys. Like I'm very, very good at acting and I'm very good at my fashion sense because I really think outside the box when it comes to 
fashion and dressing i think to how you can merge this with this i always crack my brain on things like that when i picture something in my head i always want to wear it to see how cute it is so that alone is my talent so anybody asks me that's my talent and i don't care what anybody thinks about that so that's what gave me the confidence and my life on how to think about talent and all that so the next is what do you do when you wake up so i think the first thing i do when i wake up is to pray then i go through my phone then i think after that i brush my teeth and to the rest then the next is if you are the last but question is if you are extremely quiet what does it mean it means i'm either sad or i'm mad but mostly it means i'm very mad so that's all i have for you guys today i hope you guys enjoyed this video and give this video a huge thumbs up don't forget to like comment subscribe and share this video with your friends and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already please just subscribe to my channel be with the fam be with this cute girl please and help me reach my goal of a thousand subscribers by the ending of this year and i would love to share more content with you guys the more you guys subscribe the more it gives me really good content to share for you guys and i want to thank all of you that have subscribed to my channel i love you guys so much stay safe stay healthy and we'll go through this phase together bye